Surprise! I'm streaming again. Second time today. Hi, everybody. I'm double dipping. I'm double dipping. I had a, a stream earlier. Which I'll probably end up mentioning a couple times throughout the course of this stream. Uh, I don't know. I kind of felt like streaming again. I've been meaning to check out this game for a while. KY recommended it. It's gotten pretty big on Twitch. It's had some great reviews and, and um, people keep telling me about it. So let's check it out. Um, but I streamed earlier, I streamed like Monster Hunter for like three and a half hours. <laughs> so this is considered a double stream. Alright, so it's early access. There's your disclaimer. It does seem like a fairly well-made early access game from what I understand. Now this is, this is a card game. I have not played it. I put my name in. And it's called Slay the Spire. And it is, um... I don't know what it is, it's kind of like a roguelite card-ish game? Roguelite card-ish game, let's call it that for now. And, uh, I've only seen it in action, I don't love the visual style. The Ironclad. Okay, so I'm, I'm gonna be- Okay, I'm gonna suck at this. I'm going to be playing this game poorly. Uh, and I have a little experience with card games, and I'll tell you about that in a minute. I haven't played a whole lot of them, but I, I have- I, I like card games. I mean, back to the bones. A little bit. Uh, I guess that's the Spire. Huh. I guess we'll just jump on in, right there. Start at left. Defeat enemies by playing cards from your hand. Cards require energy to play once you're out and your turn. At the start of your turn, new cards are drawn and energy is replaced. Or replenished, sorry. I talked about this game a little bit with KY, and uh, he kind of explained it to me, and I was like, hmm. That seems pretty good. So, let me just take a look at this. Play defensive cards. Uh, and again, like I said, I streamed uh, for a couple hours of Monster Hunter earlier, so if card games aren't your speed and you want to see me kill some monsters, check the VOD. I'm not expecting everyone to be down for a game like this. But uh, this could, this might not turn into like a long series of me streaming this. This might just be a one off. So I guess um, let, let's see what's up. So I have some very basic cards, right? Okay, what's this? Draw pile? Okay. Oh, I see. You click the card, click the enemy. How many cards do I get to play? Three? Um, this game has like eight or nine thousand viewers on Twitch. <clears throat> I can't really... And again, I don't love the art style. I think this is probably gonna be refined, I hope, but um, I'm surprised at how big this game got so quickly. This kind of thing just kind of came out of nowhere. Not enough energy. Oh, okay. Alright, I'm out of energy, so I can't play the cards. Let's end the turn. Um, I've got Bash here. Deal six damage, apply to vulnerable. Vulnerable creatures take 50% more damage from attacks. You're aggressive, not vulnerable. Okay. Oh, oh, now you're vulnerable. I see. Energy costs. This is one energy. I have zero again. I'm not good at managing my energy. Defense is always a priority over offense in this game. Whoops. If there are no cards to draw, your discard pile is shuffled into the draw pile. Okay, well, I have some pretty fucking rancid cards at the moment. I, I have very basic strike and defend cards. But I killed a fucker. Single player card games are an underdeveloped market. Sure. So my experience with card games, um, like I, I liked Hand of Fate too. That's obviously a little different. Swift Potion. Drink or throw potions during combat. Potions 
stay with you between rooms and add a card to your deck. This card applies a power to you when used. Okay. Got it. Oh, I get to choose. Um, create a copy of an attack or power card in your hand. Deal nine damage. Draw one card. I like that one. Um, I played a little bit of Magic the Gathering. I collected the cards for a while. I've played uh, Boss Monster. That's a little different. I played Pokemon game. Don't tell anyone. Um, so I wasn't like huge on card games. I played very little bit of Hearthstone. Not like the biggest card game fan in the world. So like I'm saying, I might not end up streaming this forever, but I'm checking it out. Okay, so let's do the pommel strike. Nine damage plus draw a card, which will be strike in this case. Um, and defend. End turn. The TNG card game. I have the cards. I had the, like, Star Wars Episode One cards as well. Never got a chance to actually play it, or if I did, maybe a couple times. Just a warning, but the bats back seeking. Wow. Just a warning, but the back seating can get intense with this game. I believe it. I've already seen a lot of, like, Vinny, why are you playing a baby card game? I mean, it's it's now a baby. It was. So yeah, there's gonna be backseating. Um, I am terrible at this game because this is my first... 15 minutes playing it. <laughs> Pinot, why are you not the expert at the games that you play all the time? You start the game, you'll be expert, like me. I was never bad at the video game. Never. Deal 4 damage, place a copy of this card into your discard pile. That costs 0. Gain 8 block, draw 1 card. Gain 5 block, upgrade a card in your hand for the rest of combat. Upgrading cards makes them more powerful. Cards can only be upgraded once. Let's do that one. Vinny, when will the next Monster Hunter World stream happen? Um, earlier. A three and a half hours of Monster Hunter. I did it. Choose a card to upgrade. Let's do Strike Plus. Interesting. Kaka. Oh, right. You're a bird. I'm sorry, I didn't know you were a bird at first. Defend here. Vinny, do you like the smiths? I think they're okay. I don't know, I, you know, the smiths weren't huge in the US. So I know a couple songs and I really like those songs that I like, but I don't, I don't know like their entire discography. It's like, there are a number of bands that were huge in the UK that didn't quite make it over. To the U.S. Oh, thanks, Zito. Okay, I see what that... Okay. Alright, so we'll do the block again. And I'm gonna upgrade Bash. Bash Plus. Nice. And super vulnerable now. Gotcha. Violence towards birds. Oh yeah, I like I like to instigate violence against birds in video games. Not in real life though. I like real life birds just fine. <laughs> just fine. Deal five damage to all enemies. X time. Anger. Let's do the anger. It's free. Geese aren't birds, they're fucking Satan. Interesting. I don't know what happened there, so... 
you, you just keep growing clones of the anger card? Is that how that happens? That seems kind of cool. You can get, like, a bunch of angers in a row, and then you have, like, two or three infinite hits. Well, not infinite, but free. Free hits. It's like free love, man. From the 60s, you know what I mean? This makes the thing, whatever, the fungi beast grow. Oh, I love this, by the way. This is a great enemy design. Maybe I'm partial because mushrooms, but the mushroom, like a parasite, has invaded the nervous system of this poor rat. We're rats. We're rats. But, and it is using its own mushroom tendrils to command movement. I love it. Okay, what's... <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm unreasonably excited about this. Um, I'll upgrade the Pommel Strike. Pommel. He's dead. Cordyceps? Oh, I'm aware of Cordyceps. Everyone else I've seen just zooms through this game. I didn't realize you could be this slow-paced. I know, right? It's it's crazy to think that someone who's playing the game for the first time could be so slow at it. But there was a kappa at the end of the sentence, so it was it was fine. One, two, three. Okay, fungi rat is dead. Heal three HP at the end of each turn for five turns. I like that. I need that. Okay, next card. Sever Soul. Exhaust all non-attack cards in your hand. Deal 16 damage. That's... Interesting. I'll take it. Just for the variety of cards. What's this? Merchant. Hi. I have 169 gold. Okay, so I can buy... Uh, lose 4 HP. Gain... Um, energy. Draw three cards. Exhaust. Exhaust is removed until the end of combat. Somehow I knew before reading. Rapture. Whenever you lose HP from a card, gain plus one strength. That's cool. Um. Sadistic nature. Whenever you apply a debuff to an enemy, they take three damage. How about dark shackles? Enemy loses nine strength for the rest of this turn. Interesting. Deal five damage twice. Warcry. Draw one card. Place a card from the hand on top of your draw pile. Exhaust. What's this? Items. Card removal service. Um, explosive potion, deal 10 damage to all enemies. Apply 6 poison, so you get a bunch of different item choices, you get card choices. I'm gonna go for, um... Uh, I'm gonna go for, uh... Warcry, sounds interesting. It's free. I like the free cards. We will continue. We'll carry on. Smith. You can upgrade a card in your deck. Pommel Strike to Pommel Strike Plus. I guess that kind of carries over. So... Let's see what happens when you get Anger. Yeah, I kind of like the Anger card. Free Anger. Oh, I guess it was Smith or Rest. One or the- Ah, oh, fuck, it was one or the other. Alright. Check armaments upgrade. Okay, I'll do that whenever I get a chance to. That this was. I'm still very, very new to this. Um, sever so exhaust all non attack cards in here and deal 16 damage. I'm fighting spike slimes. They just look like gray shit. Keeping a small deck with only extremely powerful cards is the winning strategy. Okay. 
apply deal eight damage, apply two honor. I'm starting to understand how that would make sense. Exhaust all non-attack cards. So, like, just get rid of them. Oh, I don't think I want to get rid of them. Weakened. Blocked. Five. Oh, fuck. Five. Damn. That's a lot of damage. Anger plus, thank you. Bring bring me the anger, please. Strike. Strike. Defend. It only exhausts the one you have in your hand. I didn't want to lose those, though. And it, it, they're exhausted until the end of combat. Also, these little fucking gray poops are doing a lot of damage. What am I going to upgrade? Um, rupture. Doesn't even upgrade. Oh, it's free. Okay. Sure. It's a good upgrade. vanilla art style animation is killing me for this, but maybe it'll grow on me in time. Yeah, that's kind of my issue with the game, but I, I appreciate the attempt to do some art, and it's not just cards. But, yeah, as a card game, it's pretty cool so far. I think when you die, you just start with your original hand again. I think it has probably, like, Isaac... Isaac-ish progression, I'm not sure. Look at those free anger sons. Let's do a war cry. Choose a card to put on top of your draw pile. Um, huh? Okay. Maybe I don't understand the utility of that fully. Good block. Oh, you can... Okay, I see. You can block a couple times. I'm starting to get it. I like it. Again, this may not turn into a regular series on the stream, but I'm happy to check out a game that actually does its job. Deals 9 damage. Place a card from your discard pile on top of your draw pile. Yeah? Okay. Oh, there's loot. This way. And there's a fucking fireplace. I want to get that. We can relax. You need to go. Like, you need to go immediately. Uh, how am I going to get you a strike? Fuck, you're still alive. Cock. Okay. Okay. I'm good. Okay, I'll be able to kill the- <laughs> the louse. Thought it was like a- a baby fetus pig. Attack first, jawworm. Ah, oh, man. Oh, that hit. That hurt. That hurt, too. Bad moves. You have to go. Gain plus five block, and I want to upgrade um, Rupture again for a free Rupture. And then I can uh, do a strike and another defend. So now I should be good against damage. I think. Okay, well, he just buffed himself. Go fuck it. Go buff yourself. Okay, War Cry. Draw one card. 
sever soul. Um, okay. Um, I'm gonna use the sever soul, I think. Oh, I, yeah. Wait, no, I don't have defense at the moment. I'm gonna hold on to that. I need the defense. Sure. Ow! Okay, I don't, I don't think I fully played that right. Alright. You have been tossed. Strength potion at a card. Deals 32 damage. Gain 5 block, deal 5 damage. I'm gonna do the 32 damage. I don't know why. It just feels right. Whetstone. Upon pickup, upgrade two random attacks. Oh fuck, bludgeon got bludgeon plus. That thing now does 42 damage. Cool. Cool. We're gonna rest this time. I got some of my HP back, so that's good. Um, this is an elite enemy, but I've got bludgeon. Oh fuck, he's naked. Gremlin knob. Yeah, knob that boglin. This enemy intends to use a buff. Alright, good. So that means I can, um... I can attack without defend- without defending. I see now, I see. Right? Am I correct? Don't attack me, please. Enrage. Strategic. This enemy intends to inflict a negative effect on you and attack for six damage. Alright. Get some anger going. Um, let's get a random card. Okay, let's get rid of the defense. Strike, defend, strike, and turn. Okay, took a little bit of damage there. Not too bad. Deal nine damage. Upgrade. Okay, let's do this. I'm gonna upgrade, um... Headbutt. Deal more damage. Yeah. Choose a card to put on the top of your draw pile. Anger. We'll defend. He's going to, what, attack for 33 damage? Fucking hell. Oh, man. I really should have mouse over that first. Forty-two damage. Die. Thanks. See ya. Self-forming clay. Whenever you lose HP in combat, gain three block next turn. Um, heal three HP at the end. Okay, good. And, uh... At the end of your turn, lose 1 HP and deal 4 damage to all enemies. Infernal Blade. Add a random attack to your hand. Costs 0 this turn. That could be good with Bludgeon. I'm gonna head to the Merchant. I need some, um, HP, perhaps. We can even do... Card Removal Service, just in case you have too many cards. I can see how too many cards would be a problem. I can't just straight up heal at the merchant. It adds a random attack, not just the ones you own. Oh, okay. You can also get negative cards. Oh, that, that wouldn't be good. Um, upgrade all your cards for the rest of combat. Exhaust. I can't afford it, but that's kind of cool. Um, is this the Black Lotus card? Bronze Scales. Whenever you take damage, deal three damage back. I like that. I'm gonna be taking damage. 
Okay, I have to head to a rest area, but I have to kill an acid slime now. Okay. What card? Sever soul. Exhaust all your non-attack cards in your hand. Okay, I'm good. Confirm that. Use this. What are you gonna do? It's gonna attack for 16 damage. There's 16 to you. Deal 9 damage. Place the card from your discard pile. Okay, no, I'm, I'm, I'm good. I'm gonna take some damage here. Should have drank that potion. Kind of made that mistake. Drink. Thank you. Bludgeon plus anger plus. Plus. I could do the bludgeon. Or I can use two defense. And not worry about the bludgeon. I think I'm gonna be careful here. I'm gonna be super careful. I don't know how this is gonna work. I wanna see how this goes. That's good. Random attack to your hand. It costs zero this turn. Exhaust. Iron wave. Oh, cool. Defense and offense. Armaments. Oh, I should have used that earlier. Um, I will upgrade... That. So I can play that for free. Oh, oh, split. I thought it said spit. <laughs> Unplayed cards cannot be played from your hand. I don't- okay, so that's just a shitty card. Vinny is doing it on purpose, I feel. I- what? I've never played the game. What do you mean? Oh, I'm missing the backseating. Yeah, because I want to learn the game. I want to play the game, you know, I mean, I, I'll look over. If I ask for help, I'll ask for it, and, I, and you guys can can help. But I kind of want to learn on my own. Negative effect. Okay, anger plus. I can get rid of one of them. This is going to attack me, though. Alright. I have to take some of that damage. Um, okay. Sever Soul is 16, right? Uh, what do you plan on doing? Negative effect. Okay, I might be able to kill this fucker. I have to strike it. No, well, maybe. Okay, use your negative effect, as long as it doesn't do damage. LEAK! Okay, I'm weakened, but... One more hit. Oh. Two more hits! I'm not reading what the cards do. Oh, I didn't know I wasn't reading. Deal three damage to a random enemy three times. Deal 12 damage, apply two weak. It's sword boomerang. Um, should I go for random or a monster? I'm gonna go for random. You come across an inconspicuous pedestal with a shining gold idol sitting peacefully atop. It looks incredibly valuable. You sure don't see any traps nearby. Nah. If there was ever an obvious trap, this would be it. You decide not to interfere with objects placed upon pedestals. Uh, 
It's only ruptured your misunderstanding. It does nothing with the current card since none of them hurt you. Okay. So rupture is the card I have to read a little bit better then. Okay, fair enough. I, I understand, I accept. So let's let's read it. Whenever you lose HP from a card, gain one strength. So these are only my cards. So if a card here hurts me, then rupture. So rupture is useless for me right now because this this is basically, um, this is a card. Someone said emo cards. Okay, I understand. I think. Okay, cool. Mode shift. After taking 30 damage, changes to defensive mode. This enemy intends to block and use a buff. Um, start with War Cry. Maybe I can get an upgrade for the bludgeon. Oh, you can only upgrade the bludgeon once. Choose a card. Let's get rid of that. This enemy intends to attack for 9 damage, and whenever you play an attack, you take 3 damage. Alright. Um... I'm gonna use the, um, Strength Potion. We'll use the Infernal Blade and get Body Slam. Deal damage equal to your current block. 12 damage. And I don't take any damage because I'm blocking it. Slay the Spire Dev underscore official is here. I have my suspicions, however. We're gonna go for a defend. I wonder, will rupture work now? Cause I'm gonna take damage from the spikes. No. Alright. What do you intend to do? Uh, attack for eight damage two times, fuck. You just need to use a card from your hand. Okay. I understand. Um... Let's see... Headbutt. Discard pile. I'm gonna get the uh, bludgeon back. Took a bit of damage there, but I'm I'm feeling I'm feeling a little bit better. Um, I can bludgeon this motherfucker. Cane plus uh, five block. Upgrade a card in your hand. Well, I don't need to upgrade bludgeon. Let's do it. Mode shift. All right, halfway. Halfway. I have no defense, but it's using a buff, so I'm good. More defense. Um, what are you gonna do? Nine damage. Vinny, it took me four runs to get to the first boss. What the fuck? Ah. Ah, oh, wow. I'm gonna take a little bit of, uh, of a hit here. Um, 
Let's end turn. No defense. Exhaust all your non-attack cards in your hand. What are you going to do? Eight damage twice. Defend. Okay, double defend. I hope this doesn't damage me that many times. It didn't. Okay, that was, that was pretty good. Alright. Okay. Okay. Hummel strike. Hard. Yeah. What are you gonna do? Attack uh, for five damage four times. Shit. I need. I definitely need that. We're gonna do anger. And, um. Okay. <laughs> oh man. Oh, we're cutting it close. Yourself. Quit hitting yourself. Bludgeon. Good night. Wow. Okay. Whenever you uh, gain block, deal three damage to random enemy. At the start of each turn, gain two strength. Demon form. Deal four damage to all enemies. Heal for unblocked damage dealt. Reaper. What have you got? Choose a relic, huh? Gain um, magic at the start of each turn. You can no longer gain gold. Oof. Game magic at the start of each turn starts combat with two wounds in your draw pile. Wounds are unplayed status cards. Game magic at the start of each turn. You can no longer see enemies' intents. I think the mark of pain probably feels a lot better. Vinny, a lot of the games you've been playing lately have had demons in them. Is there something you want to tell us? <laughs> no, Desert, of course not. I need the mark of pain. All of those relics had some negative shit going on there. Tell me about yourself, bartender. Okay, so I have four, so that's good. Can play more stuff. Kind of like Warcry just to get an extra card. Um, get rid of that for now. Okay, Rupture. Whenever you, oh fuck, it was Rupture. <laughs> God damn it! Whoops. Pommel strike, please. Oh, I should have done Bash first. Yeah, mistakes were made. A couple mistakes there were made. What are you? You're gonna block on this turn. Okay. That's a lot of fucking HP you have, or rather block P. Place a card from the discard pile on top of your draw pile. Wound unplayable. Let's do the Infernal Blade. And I get Reckless Charge. Deal 9 damage for a vulnerable. Strike plus. What do you ten intend to do? You you're gonna do something. Okay, so I'll block that. The best I can. Okay, 
and turn. I'm definitely taking damage here. Get some anger. Um, I can get an armament. So we'll increase the damage. Can't really do anything else. What do I have? Energy potion. Gain two energy. If I needed to. I'm already down to this much HP. That fucking sucks. Let's see. Clash Plus can only be played if you're... If every card in your hand is an attack. Oh, okay. Searing Blow. Deal 12 damage can be upgraded any number of times. Power through. Add two wounds to your hand. Gain 15 block. I'm gonna get that. I feel like I'm gonna end up needing that. I didn't realize how much defense was important in this game. It's- it's fucking important. Um... Enlightenment. That's cool. Uh, I'm probably gonna get an HP potion. Whenever you rest, you may add a card to your deck. The first time you lose HP each combat, draw three cards. Gain on the first turn of each combat. Gain energy, lose HP. Gain block, exhaust a random card in your hand. Remove rupture. Alright. By rupture. I, you know, I might eventually need it, but... Remove card, my guy. See, now that was helpful. Okay, random event. Event. In front of you sits an altar to a forgotten god. Atop the altar sits an ornate female statue with arms outstretched. She calls to you, demanding sacrifice. This wouldn't make my knees explode, right? Why would I want this? Locked requires golden idol. Fuck. Let's do another question mark. Oh. It's an enemy. No defense. This enemy intends to inflict a powerful negative effect on you. Perfected Strike. Deal 20 damage. Deals an additional 2 damage for all of your cards containing Strike. Oh, <laughs> that's- I don't have any with other cards with Strike. I'm going to use this on Bash. There we go. You got a whole deck of them? Oh, okay, you're talking about the whole deck. So... Pal pommel Strike, Strike... I see, I see what you mean. I thought it meant just here. Okay, we're good. What are you gonna do? 27 damage. Ah! Ah! I need... Well, healing is nice. Power through. Gain 15 block. I might need to power through. 
I could power through and then defend twice, and then I'd more or less be able to block most of the damage. But Reaper is kind of cool too. All right, let's um, let's do that. Defend, defend, power through. All right. And I don't have enough magic for the next card. Didn't the hex completely get rid of his defenses? I don't know. Let's see. Whenever you play a non-attack card, shuffle one dazed into your draw pile. Oh. Oh, man. Well, at least I'll survive this. Take just two damage from that. I'll fucking take two damage. Bludgeon, see ya. Cool. Pommel strike plus, headbutt. Body slam. Deal damage equal to your current block. Um, deal 10 damage, draw two cards. I'm gonna go for that one. Monster here. Snake plant. Snake plant. Snake plant. What are you gonna do? Attack me for seven damage three times. Fuck off. Let's start with that. Hoping this is a good one. And it's another sword boomerang. I'm gonna take a lot of damage here. A lot of damage. And he just... Look at this, the snake plant just keeps getting more and more. He's getting more and more armor. Fook. Ah. Uh, it was a good run, lads. Yeah, I have way too many cards. Start with Reaper, I'll get some of my HP back. And then I can, um... Oh, I should have done Bash first. Fuck. Fuck! Armament. Ho 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 ho! Ho 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 ho! Not enough energy. Okay, alright! Fucking out. Go ahead, do it! If you bashed, he would have blocked the Reaper. Oh, right, right, right. Hmm. Okay, I'm not gonna take damage here. Get to draw some cards. Plus headbutt. Let's do a headbutt. Choose a card to put on top of your draw pile. Um, where's the healing? Reaper. Where's Reaper? Reaper. Oh, okay, never mind. We'll do armaments. And um, strike. And I, I wish I had one more attack card, but I'm good. Oh, man. Almost no HP left. Just a little bit. Upgrade all cards in your hand for the rest of combat. Yes? 
And here's an elite. An elite before the campfire. God damn it. It's fucking Hollow Knight. Start with armament. Now they're all upgraded. What are you gonna do? Block, 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 and use a buff. Okay. I got bludgeon. Um, I guess we'll get rid of um, strike. Protect. They also attack, but at the moment they're protect. Get them, boys. Minions abandon combat without a leader. Increase attack damage by three. They're gonna block, they're gonna block. You're gonna attack for a lot. Okay. Okay. Nine times three. Um... I'll survive this. Barely. Keep adding armor to him. Uh, uh. What are you gonna do? Okay, I need Reaper. Get some of my health back. Um, I can't really do a whole lot else and turn. This could be the end. Armaments. Okay, what are you gonna do? 12 times 3. Okay, great. 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 12 times 3. Is there a leave? Can I leave combat? There's no escape, only death. Comforting. Twelve HP left. Block and buff. Okay. Anger. I'm gonna get rid of the shield goblin. Um. Okay, shield goblin gone. If you kill minions, attack boss, repeat, he uses his time resummoning them. That's good. Well then, fuck it, I'll just kill the minion. I get one more, I get one more turn. To, um, 
Maybe live a little bit. Strength. Oh, man. Oh, man. 15 damage times 3. I got... I have to kill. Oh, God, I have to kill. Uh, reckless charge. That's free. Okay, that's shit. Um... Bludgeon. I need a better bludgeon than that, man. I will use the energy. I will use the potion here. But I need to... I need to draw new cards. Upgrade a card in your hand for the rest of combat. Okay. Can I upgrade bludgeon? No, I can't. There is no upgrade. Um, yeah, Bludgeon's already upgraded. You can't go further. Deal 12 damage? No. Deal 9 damage. Deal 12 damage. I've done the math. This isn't happening. M maybe. Maybe. Got two more cards. I got a defend card. That's not going to help. I need to do 22 damage. Well, that's not happening. Not enough energy. Alright, see you later. We've done the math. It's terminal. The Scapelli brothers, they're gonna win. Unlock a new character. Okay, main menu. Well, that was a good run. That was my first run ever. Um, let me do another one. What's this character? 70 HP. At the start of each combat, draw an additional two cards. At the end of combat, heal six HP. I'm gonna stick with the Ironclad. And continue unlocking for the Ironclad. What? Excuse me? Greetings, I am Yao. Choose. Oh. Okay. Permanent upgrade? Lose your starting relic. Obtain a random boss relic. Um, chat, any ideas? Oh, it's for this run only. Lose 50% recurring HP, choose a rare card. Alright, let's do it. Um, whenever a card is exhausted, draw one card. At the start of each turn, gain two strength. Or, deal ten damage. If this kills a non-minion enemy, gain three permanent max HP. Kind of like feed. Yeah, I kind of like feed. What are you gonna do? Seven. No, you're not. There it is. Um, I've done the math, lads, and, and it's not gonna work. It's gonna attack me for 12 damage. I have to do at least... I only have that one. 
do that. All right. Gonna take some damage here. It's a huge disadvantage to start with less than 50% health now. But what are you doing? More damage? Awesome. I've done the math. That's gonna become a popular quote for this game. I can fucking feel it. Where's Daisy? Wasn't good math. Wasn't done properly. Eleven damage. To play like super defensively. Shrug it off. You're gonna have to okay, so I can get that. That's a good... That's a good card. And then, um... That negates all of the Jaw Worm's damage. And then I need to, um... Hopefully try to end with Feed, if possible. And I won't be able to this turn. What are you going to do? You're going to block and buff. Alright, um, well... Eh. I, I want to try to hold out for feed, I really need that extra HP. Come on, feed, come on, feed, come on, feed! No, f no. I think I'm going to hold out one more time. There it is. Alright. That's how you do it. Save up a little bit. Uh, double tap. This turn, your next attack is played twice. I can see that being extremely useful. Deal four damage and apply one vulnerable to all enemies. Kind of like double tap. You walk into a room and find a large hole in the ground. As you approach the hole, an enormous serpent creature appears from within. Who? Who? Hello, hello, what have we got here? Hello, adventurer. I ask a simple question, the most fulfilling of all lives. Of all lives is that in which you can buy anything. Do you agree? I don't think I want to answer this question. Perhaps the same can be said of all religions. Unplayable. At the end of your turn, gain one week. But then I can remove this card. If I get the money and then I hit a merchant, I can then spend 75 to sell it. Yes. Yes, this will be worth it. The serpent rears its head and blasts a stream of gold upwards. It is amazing and terrifying simultaneously. You gather all the gold, thank the snake, and get going. Just I have to find a merchant now. Among the stone and boulders, you notice an intricate, large blue statue resembling a wing. You find gold spilling from its cracks. Maybe there is more inside. Um. Pray. 
Remove a card from your deck, lose 7 HP. Wait, what? It wouldn't give me a choice of removing card. Someone once told you of a cult that worshipped a giant bird. As you kneel in prayer, you begin to feel lightheaded. You wake up some time later feeling strangely fleet of foot. Oh, there we go. 7 HP to remove this shitty card. Worth it. But now I only have 23 health. Fuck. This enemy intends to attack for 5 damage. And there's a negative status effect there. the negative status weakened. Tax deal 25% less damage for two turns. I can feed. Yes, good feed. Yes, it's good. Sensitive, yes. Yes, I like context sensitive. Swift potion. And another card. There's the anger card. I'm gonna go for anger. Free damage, free damage. Um, I don't see any merchants nearby. But I have a lot of money now. Oh, there's a merchant. Okay. Hello, mate. It's me, Steve, a merchant. Metallicize. The enemy is asleep. Okay. I attacked with the wrong thing first. Yeah. The enemy is stunned on its turn. Okay. 18 damage. Eighteen damage. Now twelve damage. Mm. <sighs> now only three damage. damage again. Hmm. This thing, motherfucker. This is going to be a good term for damage. Um, I don't think I'm going to be able to... Uh, anger. I don't think I'm going to be able to kill this. Maybe. I mean, it's, it's, it's possible. Strength down. That's okay. It's okay. It's free anger. Okay, I've, I've done the math and I cannot kill. Oh, 
I'll survive by 1 HP. <laughs> 1 HP, here we come. Oh, there's gotta be some kind of an achievement for that. <laughs> yes, I live. At the start of your turn, lose 15 block rather than all of your block. Okay. And, um... Metallicize. At the end of your turn, gain 3 block. Until next- Okay, wait a minute. At the end of your turn, gain 3 block. Is this worth it? It looks- I mean... That's the end of your turn for the rest of combat. Oh. Yeah, that's good. I'll take it. Now I can rest up a little bit. Get some HP back. <laughs> I'm still almost fucking dead, but... Oh boy. Um, okay, I'm not gonna go for an elite, so we'll just go here. Spore Cloud. Get a buff. Okay, I'm alive. Weakened. Okay, you will attack. You'll be dead! Maybe. Now you're dead. Okay, we're gonna get licked again. Great. Fucking great. I'm gonna need that metallicize. I'm gonna do a double tap on it. Oh, it's an attack only. Um, okay, now now's the time to defend. And defend heavily. Good. Does a feed come back? No. Are you gonna attack again? And there's- oh, fuck, I love that card. Metallicize is great. Especially if you use it early. What if you use it more than once? Can you? Or is it discarded? I think it gets discarded. Yeah, it's just a one thing. One time thing. Um, I don't have feed. I do not have feed. Not yet, I don't. You could use it more than once if you have more of them. Okay. Here's the feed. Nice. Extra HP, fuck yeah. Dexterity Potion. Dexterity improves block gained from cards, that's good. Oh, fucking bludgeon is back! Deal 6 damage, deals an additional 2 damage for all your cards containing strike. Blood for blood. Costs one less magic for each time you lose combat, uh, HP in combat. Double tap, plus bludgeon. Sounds good. I'm seeing a lot of people say a lot of different things. Six damage, deals an additional plus two for all of your cards containing strike. Yeah, I can't bludgeon twice. Um, I can if I manage to defeat this first area. Huh. Double tap perfected strike sounds nice. I'm gonna stick with it. I'm gonna play it safe. Kunai. Every time you play three attacks in a single turn, gain one dexterity. Okay.
You come upon a dapper-looking, cheery gremlin. It's time to spin the wheel! Are you ready? Of course you are! Wow, that wheel was drawn. There's so... So much time was put into making this wheel. What's that? Am I dying? Uh-oh, you lose. You spot him readying a shiv. You slash at the crazy gremlin, but he's simply too quick. He gets you a few times with a crude shiv. The price has been paid! And with that, both the gremlin and its wheel disappear in a puff of smoke. It's a torture device for the modern age. Fucking Rich Evans. Did, did Rich Evans make the wheel? This dude steals gold. Stop taking my gold. There we go. Double tap. Perfected strike. It's pretty fucking good. That's 32 for three. Which is the same as bludgeon now that I think about it. <laughs> Um, another shrug it off is good. I'll take another one of those. Okay, so it's basically all monsters from here on out. Three monsters in a row, then a campfire. No merchant, which sucks because I have a lot of gold. I may never see a merchant on this run. Okay, so we're doing, uh, what are we doing here? We're, we're doing attacks? Nope, nope, negative effect, so I can... Should have opened with bash. Always open with bash. Dexterity. Okay. Block has been improved. Frail. Okay. So what are we doing? 16 damage. Vinny, why don't you upload entire streams instead of the individual games? It's easier for people to find the game they want to watch. I'm gonna go full defense here. I don't want to risk taking any damage. Um, I can do some metallicize if I really needed to. I'm gonna I'm gonna do that. And I'm also gonna hit the perfected strike. Enemy's intentions are unknown. Oh, it's split again. You're going to attack. That's fine. You can do one defense. That'll negate all the damage. Great. Oh, plus I got more um, dexterity. That kunai is fucking awesome. Attacks happening here. <laughs> More block gained. I 
Just get some decent block at the end of every turn automatically now. Nice. Oh, that's perfect. Yeah. yeah! What's this? Body slam. Deal damage equal to your current block. Thunderclap. And deal 12 damage, apply 2 weak. I'm gonna go for that. So they do less damage to me. I'm going to be attacked here. So we'll start with Metallicize, because that's a very good starter. That's a good opener. Um, kind of don't want to take any damage. Someone tell Vinny. <laughs> That defense against no damage carries to next turn. Okay. I'll remember that. Or I'll try to. Hmm. Okay, I'll be good. Take one damage here. Less. None damage. Let's so we'll get some anger. I need... Oh, man. Alright, well, I need to feed upon this... This rat. This spore rat. I just ate it. Feels good. Tastes good. Is good. Defense does not carry to the next turn. That's a jape. Someone tell Vinny that defense against no damage carries to next turn. Someone tell him. <laughs> like, what? Only over 15. Okay. Exhaust all non-attack cards and do 16 damage. Deal 9 damage. Place a card from your discard pile on top of your draw pile. Deal 7 damage to all enemies. Um... Skip. No, oh, Cleave sounds alright. There's utility for cleave. Little, nothing wrong with little cleavage. See, now this is where cleave comes in handy. <laughs> this is where cleave gives you a handy. I'm, I'm an adult. Took quite a bit of damage here. Okay, I could use that cleave right about now. Where is that shit? I can feed upon this little shit nugget. Well, damn. Cleave. Shrug it off, and maybe another shrug it. No, I'm good. I could just 
perfected strike. Ah, uh, fuck it. No double tap on the cleave. Oh yeah, why didn't I do double tap on the cleave? That was just a mistake. That was an error. That's all that was. Actually, I could have, uh, not used that, because I have the, the crystallize thing. Metallicize. Right. <laughs> Slimes have proved to be a bigger problem than I expected. Inflame. Gain two strength. Armaments. I like armaments. I'm gonna get that one. Armaments has been good. I'm gonna recover HP here. Definitely gonna recover HP. And it's boss time! What the fuck are you? Hexaghost! Uh, okay. Metallicize with a perfected strike. No music? Never mind. Oh god. Seven times six? You're joking. God damn it. Okay, this time it's just six. But still, fuck that. Should block that. No? But I thought... The thing here. The thing. Increased block. Increased block! Dex- Oh right, it has no effect on metallicize. God damn it. I gotta remember that. Okay, survive that. Clothesline, yeah, clothesline. Yeah. Let's do... Let's upgrade the clothesline. Applies three weak. That sounds good. Lights are slowly going back to six. When that happens, it's going to be a shit show. If I had a health potion, it would be great.
need to do more damage. Yeah, I'm not doing enough damage. It's gonna be bad. In just a couple more turns, it's gonna be real fucking bad. Five times six. 30 damage. I can survive it. I can survive it. I'm gonna be okay. Defense is, is heavily upgraded. Oh man, if only I had the clothesline ability. If I could use that, that would be great right about now. But, yeah, I'm gonna survive that. No problem. Awesome. Shrug that fucking damage right off. Clean! A bunch of burn plus just got added to my deck, though. Fuck that. I'm gonna do... I think I'm gonna do a double bash here. I don't have any defensive abilities available at the moment. So we're gonna just do double bash. I have to take the hit here. Five damage. Oh my god, what is this? Oh, this is fucking beans. No. No, 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 no. Oh, no! That was a bad draw. Awful fucking draw. It's a better draw. Do that damage. That was really, really important. I'm gonna take a little bit of damage here. Oh no, 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 no. Uh, yeah, a little bit. I'm gonna take some six damage. Okay, shrug it off. How much are you doing? Uh, block and a buff, okay. Anger. I didn't even think to upgrade anger. Close line. Always draw first if you can. Yep, I realized that way too late. Did I not get the option to upgrade there? Oh, that was the wrong card, I think. Yeah, that was the wrong card. Okay. I can do this. I just need to kill for this. Like, I need to kill on this turn or the next one. Oh, I think I can do it, too. Double tap plus perfected strike. Yes! Fuck yeah. Okay, what do we got? Offering. Lose 4 HP, gain 2 energy. Uh, draw 3 cards. Exhaust. That's kind of cool. 
Um, Berserk, if your HP is at or below 50%, gain energy at the start of each turn. I kind of like, uh, offering. Juggernaut, whenever you gain block, deal three damage to a random enemy. I'm gonna go for, uh, offering. I think that'll fit my play style nicely. Okay. Replace burning blood at the end of combat. Heal 10 HP. So that's just a direct upgrade. Um, runic dome. Gain energy at the start of each turn. You can no longer see enemy intents. For every five cards in your deck, heal 2 HP whenever you enter a rest site. like the burning blood, or the black blood. It's just an upgrade. It's a slight upgrade. It helps. Okay, I need to get to a shop. Look at that full HP, too. Yeah, we're good. Oh, they're still gonna attack. God damn it. Um... Shrug it off. Let's do another shrug it off. Armaments. And we will upgrade. Um... Strike, since I got a bunch of them. It upgrades all of the cards of that kind, right? No? Oh, fuck, whoops. Ah, uh, fuck. Ah, uh, no, 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 no. Reduce attack damage taken by 50%. Cancelled if dealt attack damage three times in one turn. Damn. The unholy offering. Not enough damage, man. Stun them. Yeah, I, I am definitely misplaying. Draw first. Okay, well, I wasn't sure I was going to use the offering, but now I'm going to use the offering. So you have to attack it three times, and then it cancels its attack. Yeah, bad moves. Bad, just bad moves. That's all that is. It's just a card game. I'm confident I can turn this around. Okay. 
Okay, um... Minus 50%, right? Did the math, guys. I did the math. Just please understand that I've done the math. Um, yeah. Okay, that was good. That was very useful. They don't all cancel their attack if I hit one of them three times, right? Because the way I'm seeing it, you guys want me to just attack a lot. Okay, I see. that. That is good. That worked out. And now I can defend while that board... Does nothing. Port. This is a surprisingly difficult, like, annoy- Because I, I haven't fought these fuckers before, so I didn't really- I didn't expect it to be like this, but yeah, this is, um... It's a lot easier when, you know... When this is happening. out. Now I can end them. Cleave. Anger. Perfected strike. Fucking rest in peace. I only wish I had feed. But, let's say my math was a little off. Bloodletting. Gain energy, lose 3 HP. Combust. At the end of your turn, lose 1 HP and deal 4 damage to all enemies. It's only 1 HP. Or another perfected strike. I'm gonna go for another perfected strike. <laughs> Vinny, when are you gonna play some weird... Or slash bad Half-Life mods. Uh, if someone makes a collection, I'll, I'll play them. They gotta be good, though. Or, like, really bad, rather. Peace Pipe. You can now remove cards from your deck at rest sites. Centennial Puzzle. The first time you lose each HP each combat, draw three cards. That seems pretty great. Um, you can now gain strength at rest sites. Problem with that relic is you can overdraw if you use offering. It's permanent strength. Um. Exhaust one card, draw two cards. Every time you play five cards in a single turn, deal ten damage to all enemies. <laughs> I like that one. Um, should I get... Giria? Giria? No? 
iron wave. Maybe I just wait for the next uh, next shop. Gain five block, deal five damage. I'll get that. Okay, I spent a lot of money. Should I hit up the other shop? <laughs> you may as well. What do you have? Whenever you rest, you may add a card to your deck. Start of each combat, gain one dexterity. That's kind of cool. Oddly smooth stone. I can't get it, though. At the start of each combat, gain five plated armor. Also kind of okay. Gain two strength at the end of your turn. Lose two strength. Yeah. If you don't have any strength to lose, it's a good card to play. Keep going. Headbutt is good too. I'm gonna save my money a little bit for a potential other shop. Um, there's an elite this way. Do I have confidence to take on an elite? Probably not, but I'm gonna hit up the two question marks. You come across an ornate building which appears abandoned. The plaque that has been torn free from the wall is on the floor. It reads, The library. Inside you find countless rows of scrolls, manuscripts, and books. You pick one and cozy yourself into a chair for some quiet time. Okay. One of 20 cards. This is a lot of cards. If anyone, like, that knows this game well sees something incredible, just let me know. See another flex. Dual wield. Create a copy of an attack or power card in your hand. That looks good. Exhaust all non-attack cards in your hand and gain plus five block for each. That exhausts them. Like, it removes them. Dual wield feed. Create a copy of an attack or power card in your hand. That's- uh, yeah, that's true. You could dual wield feed. That's not a bad idea. Clash seems good in your deck. What's Clash? Um, can be played if every card in your hand is an attack. No. Disarm will buy you a lot of time and bosses. Enemy loses two strength exhaust. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what to use. Double tap is better than dual wield. Disarm or dual wield. Um, disarm. Specifically for a boss. You duck into a small hut. Inside you find what appears to be a forge. The smithing tools are covered with dust. Yet a fire roars inside the furnace. You feel on edge. Injury card here. Um, but I can upgrade it. Or I can obtain a relic. Wait, so this is if... Okay, so... 75% chance I'll be able to upgrade the card. Or is it a 100% chance I upgrade the card? And also 25% chance I become cursed.
So it's 100% for green and 75% or 25% for this. Um, what is this? Uh, normality. You cannot play more than three cards this turn. Normality is bad. Wouldn't risk it. Normality is horrible. Let's flip a coin. I'm gonna flip a coin because I know the risk and reward here, but I'm gonna flip a coin for it. Heads for forge, tails for rummage. Tails. I got cursed. You find the covered relic. Maybe you disturbed some sort of spirit. It's um, a lantern. I gain an energy first turn of each combat. So I'm going to have to find a way to get rid of that fucking normality card. ASAP. So let's flex. Um, hey, here's a question. If... I do minus two strength. Is that the same as weaken? It's a permanent. It's different. Okay. N not minus two all battle. Okay. That's good. Um, whenever you take damage from this enemy, add a wound into your discard pile. Oof. Close line. Um... Offering. I'm gonna do the unholy offering. Italicize, please. Uh, I'm gonna shrug it off. Wow, normality is fucking god awful. Oh, it's so bad. You are not kidding, chat. That's not going to be a lot of uh, fun to take that much damage. No, sir. No. Oh, that's a lot of wounds. That's a lot of wounds! Okay, get some anger plus in there. This sucks. Each time you play five cards in a single turn, deal ten damage to all enemies. Well, that's not happening. What's the upgrade? Fourteen damage. I guess we can upgrade strike. Waste of a card. I, I see what I did wrong there. I, I used the card like a dumbass. It's free. Yeah. But now it's gone, no? There we go. Duplicate those angers. Replace the wounds with anger. Wow. That is some emo shit. It's a power. It's all combat. Okay, good, good. That's great. 
think I just did it. Did I not just play five cards? It procced. I, I guess I missed it. I didn't see it proc, but... Cool. Worked out. Times six. You bastard. Oh man, another perfected strike. I can't use all these perfected strikes. Double tapping perfected would not have killed. I needed some defense there. I saw the double tap, I just didn't... I just didn't use it. Right? I'm fucked. I am fucked. Five wound cards. What? No! Do, um, oh, I don't think I can do one more run. Maybe I will, anyway. Okay, cards unlocked. Heavy Blade. Okay, soft spot, or spot weakness. Limit break. Hey, hey! It's copyright. Double your strength. Exhaust. So they just show up in future runs. Yeah, normality is, is a is fucking killer. Try the other character? Okay. I'll try the other character. I'll try to do a quick run. And, uh, it, I can save it, right? Like, halfway through? Okay, the, the whale. Okay, I need to confront the final boss before I get a uh, whale upgrade. What's the next game? The next game is Vinny Goes to Sleep. I did play Monster Hunter earlier, though. So, oh wow, they really are completely different cards. If you have, um... If you've not watched the Monster Hunter stream I did earlier, it was three and a half hours. So... You don't regen health after combat, so damage is painful. At the start of each combat, draw two additional cards. You do draw more cards, but yeah. This will probably be a short run. Gain eight block, discard a card. What are you gonna do? You're gonna buff. Basic damage and block cards are the same between characters. All other cards are unique- are unique per character. That's cool. Unique.
they do have different names. Is this motherfucker really gonna hit me for that much damage? My goal here is to take- oh fuck. Oh, I had another fucking magic. I was gonna say my goal here was to take no damage. So far I'm doing that. I forgot an attack, yeah. More strength. It needs to die now. Okay. Explosive potion. Deal four damage for each skill in your hand. Eviscerate. Costs one less for each card discarded this turn. Deals six damage three times. Poison stab. Deal five damage. Apply three poison. Poison it is. Let's see. At the start of the turn, loses three HP, then reduce poison by one. Oh yeah, that's great. Is that a person in a costume? No, it's a crow. Don't question it. Shh. Poison stacks as well, huh? That sounds even better. Yeah, this character is pretty cool. I, it sucks that you don't heal after every turn, but I kind of love this character otherwise. Um, calculated Gamble. Discard your hand, then draw that many cards. Exhaust. Discard your hand, then draw that many cards. Exhaust. It's a reroll. Okay. Choke. Deal 12 damage. Whenever you play a card this turn, targeted enemy loses 3 HP. Crippling poison. Apply three poison. Apply three weak. Hmm. I'm gonna get the gamble. That'll come in handy later, I think. People... People like it. People in chat were saying very good. Um... As you make your way... Down a long corridor, you see a banana, a donut, and a box floating about. No, upon closer inspection, they're tied to strings coming from holes in the ceiling. There is a quiet cackling from above as you approach the objects. What do you do? What's cursed? Regret. At the end of your turn, lose one HP for each card in your hand. Yeah, I'm gonna sell the um, I'm gonna sell the thing. Ice cream. Energy is now conserved between turns. Oh, that's pretty good! You grab the box. Inside you find a relic. However, you really crave the donut. You are filled with sadness, but mostly regret. Which is the name of the card. But I can get rid of that card, like, right now. So I just spent 75 on a decent relic. See ya. Okay, what, what cards do we have here? At the start of boss combats, heal 25. Man, I wish I could get that.
Every three times you shuffle your deck, gain... Okay, I can't get that stuff, so I'm not going to read it. What's, um... Deal eight damage, draw one card. Deadly poison. Apply four poison. I can't afford that one. Sucker punch. Deal seven damage, apply one weak. I'm going to go for the poison. Hey, Fred. I want to do poison build. I want to go, like, mental with the poison. So there's some poison. Does poison eat through block? It does. Good. damage here, which I'm not really crazy about, but I'll do it. Neutralize. Deadly poison. Strike. S strike. Deflect. It's free, and it's gain four block. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we're fighting an elite now. Sentry. Negates one debuff. Right? I just ran into an anti-poison mob. Okay, well it got poisoned a little bit. Dazed. And more dazed. Oh, those are cool cards. Thanks, dude. <laughs> That's a great, great start. Okay, well, there's a free four block right there. Okay. I'll take some damage here. God damn it. Use my potion. Fuck that. I have health potion too. I think now would be a good time for the health potion. Dazed. Yeah, fuck that card. Okay, that was a good round. You can save energy as well. That's right, I can. I haven't had to yet, but I, I will when I need to. Um, poison stab. Well, that needs to die. Now I can save energy, because I, I don't need the, um, 
Oh, that's awesome. Now I have two more energy for the next turn. That's great. Unless it's just more shitty, like, dazed cards. Neutralize. Mm. Calculated gamble. And we can get some poison on the fucker. And I still save a bunch of, um... I still save a bunch of energy. Six of three. Oh, that's beautiful. <laughs> Saving so much energy. Stacks of energy. It's dead. That actually worked out great, and I still have 70 health. Bronze scales. Whenever you take damage, deal three damage back. Fuck yeah, good relic. Um, outmaneuver. Energy is used to play cards from your hand. Next turn, gain two energy. Draw th three cards. Discard one card. Crippling poison. Rich Evans has this, except it's not poison. It's like Terminal 12 Diabetes. Poor Rich Evans, rest in peace. The previous Nerd Crew episode that came out about the Han Solo movie was the last work we'll ever see Rich Evans in. Type 13 was it? Oh, sorry. Should I get uh, Crippling Poison? I'm gonna get crippling poison. You fall into a puddle. It's made of slime goop. Frantically, you claw yourself out over several minutes as you feel the goop starting to burn. You can feel goop in your ears. <laughs> I almost read that as ass. I'm sorry. Goop in your nose, goop everywhere. I hate goop. Climbing out, you notice that some of your gold is missing. Looking back to the puddle, your missing coins combined with gold from unfortunate adventurers mixed together in the puddle. Fuck it, I'll get the gold. Let's get a deflect. Get a, a neutralize. Those are free. Get a defend. So now I, I don't take any damage. I take one damage this turn. And I get to apply some crippling poisons. Oh, I take no damage now. Oh wait, yes I do. Oh well. Focus fire on the left one. Before it gets a little too out of fucking control. Um, poison stab, I'll save that. Okay. You're gonna die. Quick muffs! This is a good game. Oh, I got a fire potion. Piercing whale. All enemies lose six strength for one turn. Gain five block, draw two cards. That's kind of cool. Deal eight damage. Next turn, gain one energy. I like the backflip. Especially for, you you know, a character that doesn't regenerate health. Uh, 
Uh, hmm. Left or right, chat? Let's go left. Calipers. Until next turn prevents damage. Oh, right, that's the block. Yeah, okay, so if I have more than 15 block and I don't use it, I, I get to save some of it for the next turn. So we'll do some... Um, huh. Gamble. Much better. This deck is good. I will take a little damage here. It's a bit of a mistake. Bit, uh, bit weird. Bit weird. Fucking str other strike card. I didn't do the math properly. Math was not done. Mistakes were made. Another deflect card. Add a random skill to your hand. It costs zero this turn. Draw three cards, discard one card. Been meaning to get that one. going to be attacking me now. Yes, they are. Well, I had a double defend on this one. And I think, um... Oh, I could have done the crippling... Well, you know what? This is less damage for me. And we'll, uh, poison this fucker, because it's a little weaker. I need to hit that campfire. Without taking too much more damage. Dead. No? Oh, I made- I did uh, miscalculate. I did the miscalculate. Oh, god damn it. Wasn't good enough. I didn't do the calculations properly. God damn it! Adrenaline, gain energy, draw two cards, exhaust. Acrobatics again, or quick slash, deal eight damage, draw one card. This is the only time I ever, like, thought to myself, man, I wish I had paid more attention to math while I was uh, in school.
Bit of a mistake, that. Loses 3 HP at the beginning of the next turn. Great. There we go. That was the appropriate math. bar there that shows you what's going on adrenaline is great This is going to die at the beginning of next turn. But have some more poison. <laughs> Ultra poison. It hurts more. Gain 12 block. That's a nice potion. Prepare. Draw one card. Discard one card. It's free. Apply four poison. Outmaneuver. Next turn, gain two energy. To get more poison and just go like full poison deck, but I kind of want the extra energy. Okay, so two question marks. Oh fuck, it's a battle. What the fuck are you things? Fat gremlin, mad gremlin, shield gremlin, gremlin wizard. Start with the little fella. Oh, good, good. Oh, the mad grumlin got a bunch of defense. Gain eight block. I don't need eight. Apply four poison. old man as fast as you can. Oh, shit. You weren't wrong. <laughs> Holy shit. If only I had known a little bit of this. Oh, well, that helps. Still gonna take a lot of damage. Oh, I have potions, right? That's good. It's 
to you later. And see you later, eat a dick. I was kind of hoping to save that for a boss, but that works. It's worth it not to lose more HP. Because I have a boss coming up in a couple minutes. Just time to kill the shield gremlin. Hopefully I get some strike cards. There's one. Um, draw three cards to get rid of a defend. And uh, I need the strike. Thank you. Dead. That was a long fight. Bouncing flask. Apply three poison to random enemy three times. More poison. Deal 11 damage. Innate. Exhaust. Start each combat with this card in your hand. I think this is a good one. Flask is good. Three poison to a random enemy three times. I kind of like that one better though. Especially for my poison build. Okay, what's this? You duck into a small hut. Inside you find what appears to be a forge. The smithing tools are covered with dust. Yet a fire roars inside the furnace. You feel on edge. So it's relic. <laughs> Remember normality? Or I can upgrade a card. Upgrade bouncing flask. I'm gonna upgrade the card. Yeah, I'm gonna upgrade exactly that card. Four times. Badass. I'm gonna really not risk the relic. Okay, here we go. I'll save after this. Also, just give me one moment, please. a lot of poison. Should I give him more poison? Let's do outmaneuver. I'm sure more poison will arise. Draw reduction. That sucks. How about some crippling poison? Not bad. Good, good, good. 14, yes. There's some poison. Um, I can do a calculated gamble. I'm gonna need to, actually. I need defense. That's a little lame. That's a little lame. Need 
interrupted. Attack interrupted. Perfect. It's gonna split. It won't be poisoned anymore. But, Bouncing Flask has arrived. Nice. <clears throat> you had enough to split the boss before he slammed, did I? Oh, shit. Twelve damage. It's okay, I, I just- I just need to survive. <clears throat> Deflect. Poison. Acrobatics, maybe? Yeah, acrobatics. Um, get rid of a defend, and I'm gonna give him some crippling poison. I could use my potions, I don't think I'm gonna need to just yet. Let's see, I might- now I'm probably gonna need to. I forgot I had this. Gain 12 block. That's gonna be... That's gonna be good. Let's see... What do I need? Yeah, I need that. 15. That's still not gonna be enough. My goddamn. I had to use the things. It's not gonna kill him. I was able to interrupt this one though, so that's good. I took a little bit, just two damage. It's fine. Neutralize. Strike. Goodbye. Gain six block. I don't need that. Um, I saved my energy. I have six energy next turn. Give me the flask. Yeah, there, there's the flask! Nice. I was unable to kill. I'm going to take two damage here. But now I can kill. Good shit. Bullet time. You can draw any cards this turn. Reduce the cost of cards in your hand to zero this turn. A thousand cuts whenever you play a card. Deal one damage to all enemies. And Venom. Whenever an attack deals unblocked damage, apply one poison. Hmm. Is it this good? Yeah. Whenever you deal a card, deal one damage to all enemies. Does it last the whole thing? The whole time? Thousand cuts will add up to a lot of damage. It's for the whole combat. Oh my god, that sounds great. Venom is good with poison. 
Um, cut is good with ice cream. I'm gonna go for, uh, cuts. And I know it's late as fuck, and I'm gonna go... I'm gonna stop, I'm gonna save in a minute, but I wanna do one battle on the next floor. I wanna see what that new card looks like. Gain one energy at the start of each turn. You can no longer see enemy intense. Gain one energy at the start of each turn. All enemies will start with plus two strength. Fuck that. When you would die, heal to 50% your max HP instead. I think the lizard tail. Dome is good if you're good at the game. I am not good at the game. This is my first day. Okay, these are some interesting paths. I might go for... This one right here. Okay, battle start. Where's that power? I need that power. Thousand cuts. Primo. Unfortunately, I can't do the flask as well. Suffer. Okay, neutralize. Get some poison on that thing. Block that shit, and I'll get rid of uh, this, and we'll outmaneuver for more energy next turn. Yeah, it really does add up. It really, really does add up. Here, adrenaline. It's just free damage, free one damage. Um, add some crippling poison. We'll get some... Uh, that, some of that, and turn. Vinny, I think the dude you're fighting is 12. Yo, I like Sephiroth. I want it to be like a one-winged angel like Sephiroth. Someone said unspent mana, um, and then Dan's game, angry face. I got an ice cream relic. Energy is now conserved between turns. I, these dazed cards are really fucking annoying. Wow. I have all this energy, I don't know what the fuck to do with it. Look at that. I'm gonna take 31 damage now. Eat a dick. Can I just stop here? <laughs> Can I just, like, go back? Outmaneuver Endless Agony. Whenever you draw this card, add a copy of it to your hand. Deals 4 damage. Exhaust. Riddle with holes plus. Deal four damage five times. Yep. Let's do one more. Do these question marks. Um, before you lies an elaborate shrine to a forgotten spirit. Do I have any cards I need to get rid of, guys? Remove some low cost cards like attacks from your deck. Like, get rid of some of the strikes. Okay. See you. What's this? Right, here it is, my final battle. Final battle! Riddle with holes. Um, or I can defend again. Hmm. Or I can... 
do this and defend. Uh, I'm, I'm not going to risk taking the damage as much as I'd love to see Riddle with holes in action. I need to live. I've already taken way too much damage. Poison stab, please. Great. Um, I need more defense. Mm. Dying Squirtle. Draw. Yeah, I, yeah, you gotta draw first, of course, obviously. It's 3.30, I'm making mistakes. I should probably stop playing this, like, right now. last yeah yeah this is this is sign it's a sign that I need to stop yeah what is, it, what is this the enemy intends to escape oh fuck off no 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 you cannot escape to escape with my gold. You fucking twat. You're gonna do the same thing. See ya. Fail. Fail! You will fail! Ugh. Heal hook. Deal five damage if the enemy is weak, gain energy, and draw one card. like the flying knee. Alright, now I'm gonna save. This is uh, a fucking highly addictive game. God damn, I didn't expect to like it so much. It's really good, guys. It's not gonna bring me the big numbers, but I don't really care. I kind of really like it. Maybe we will get another stream of that. It doesn't have to be like Hand of Fate level regularity, because it's just kind of a you know, it's a roguelite. But, um, yeah, it's not bad. Uh, considering I did art earlier, and there's not a ton of it, I'm gonna save the art for the next stream. So, you know, Vappy doesn't have to do, um... Another thing. Well, yeah, yeah, I just, we'll just do it next time. I'll do the art next time. Because there's only, like, six pieces. So, uh, for anyone who made art, thank you. I'll end with this one from the other night. And I'll just uh, add this six on to the next one. Thanks for watching uh, Skyrim tomorrow. It really is becoming Skyrim Saturday. But it'll be um, the usual crazy, amazing, glitchy mess that it is, I think. So maybe uh, stop by for that Sunday. Of course, we will do trash. Maybe. 
maybe some other stuff too. And I guess that's about it. So once again, for the second time today, check out vinesauce.com or twitch.tv slash team slash vinesauce for all of your streaming needs. And uh, you can enjoy you can enjoy many people. Uh, my mod Jeff is live, Vigibum. Joel is live, Dyer's live, and my auto host will take you to them. Or vinesauce.com will take you to them. Whatever you want to do. So do that and stuff. Also, again, if you missed it, I streamed Monster Hunter for like three and a half hours earlier. So if you're like, how come only one game tonight? Two. Too much, I should say. So take it easy. See you next time. And uh, stay hydrated. Keep nutrient. Eat nutrient. Goodbye.